the state's office, they've caught thousands of uninsured drivers on Illinois roads since July 1st. It's because the state changed the way it verifies insurance. Target 3 investigator Renee Cooper is live in our newsroom. So Renee, what was the process like before now? It was done randomly. A Secretary of State spokesperson tells me about 3% of car owners were selected to mail in proof of insurance each year. Now, the state has rolled out electronic automobile insurance verification. Everyone's is tw checked twice a year now, and the spokesperson says this was put in place to hold all uninsured drivers accountable and to keep them off the road. Plus, now that the system is set up, drivers nor the state have to do anything. That is, unless they're uninsured. In that case, the driver is sent a letter. They're given some time to get fully insured, and if that doesn't happen, their license plate is suspended. So far, that's happened to about 2,700 people in the last two months. One of the worst things that happens to someone is when they get involved in, an, in a crash and the person who hits them doesn't have automobile insurance. So this program definitely and strongly encourages everyone to get automobile insurance because if you don't have it, it will catch you and your license plates will be suspended. Now, spokesperson Henry Haupt says the program seems to be working without any technical issues. It requires the help of insurance companies to provide that driver data, and Haupt says a vast majority of those companies are complying. Haupt also says the program is paid for by the insurance companies and puts no burden on the taxpayer. He tells me Illinois is one of the first several states to implement automatic verification for insurance, and he says it's here to stay. Live in the newsroom, I'm Renee Cooper, WCIA3, your local news leader. Renee, thank you. Did COVID. <laughs>